Welcome to this daily office with the Iona community, which is taken from the Iona Abbey worship book. The service follows the form of morning prayer which we use on Iona, and so there are different prayers and psalms each day, and, over the course of each month, a cycle of prayers for the world, for different communities, and for the concerns of the Iona community. The service is interactive and you are invited to join with the responses, psalm and prayers. You'll see all the words you need on the screen. Through the week you will also hear different voices, those of staff, of members, of associates and of their families responding along with you. The world belongs to God, the, the earth and all its people. How good it is, how wonderful, to live together in unity. Love and faith come together, justice, justice and, and peace join hands. If Christ's disciples keep silent, these stones would shout aloud. Open our lips, O God, and, and our, our mouths shall proclaim, proclaim your praise. Let the giving of thanks be our sacrifice to God. Let the giving of thanks be our sacrifice to God. God the Lord has spoken. God has summoned all the earth. From the sun at rising to its setting in the west. Let the giving of thanks be our sacrifice to God. Let the giving of thanks be our sacrifice to God. Fire consumes before him, and a storm is raging all around. Heaven and earth he summons to the judging of his people. Let the giving of thanks be our sacrifice to God. Let the giving of thanks be our sacrifice to God. Give us life. Let, Let your people rejoice in you. Give us again the joy of your help. With your spirit of freedom sustain us. God, make our hearts clean. Restore us in body, mind and spirit. Let us pray. Trusting in God's forgiveness. Let us in silence confess our failings and acknowledge our part in the pain of the world. Before God, with the people of God, I confess to turning away from God in the ways I wound my life, the lives of others and the life of the world. May God forgive you, Christ renew you and the Spirit enable you to grow in love. Amen. Before God, with the people of God, we confess to turning away from God 
in the ways we wound our lives, the lives of others and the life of the world. May God forgive you, Christ renew you, and the Spirit enable you to grow in love. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us in the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. The response of faith. With the whole church, we, we affirm that we are made in God's image, befriended by Christ, empowered by the Spirit. With people everywhere, we affirm God's goodness at the heart of humanity, planted more deeply than all that is wrong. With all creation, we celebrate the miracle and wonder of life the unfolding purposes of God, forever at work in ourselves and the world. Psalm 96 Sing a new song, all the earth. Sing a new song to God. Sing and bless the holy name. Let God's salvation be praised each day. Declare God's glory among the nations. Tell all people what God has done. God is great, deserving of worship, worthy of praise more than worldly idols. Earthly day it is a custom built, but God is the maker of all. Sing, Sing a, a new, new song, song all the earth. earth. Sing, Sing a, a new, new song to, to God. God. Honour and splendour belong to God, in whose sanctuary are beauty and strength. Give God the glory, you families of nations, offering your gifts in God's house. Praise the Creator, clothed in holiness. Tremble with reverence, all the earth. Say to the nations, our God reigns, the world is stable, it shall not be moved. God will judge it with fairness. Sing, Sing a, a new song, song all the earth. earth. Sing, Sing a new song to God. God. Let heaven be glad, let earth rejoice. Let the sea roar and all its creatures. Let the fertile fields honour their maker. Let the trees of the forest sing for joy, for God is coming to judge the earth. The world shall be judged with justice its nations judged with truth. Sing, Sing a new song, song all the earth. the earth. Sing, Sing a new song, song to, to God. God. Listen now in the reading of scripture for the word and wisdom of God. The reading is taken from the letter to the Colossians chapter 1 verse 27, the chapter 2, verse 7. Paul writes, God chose to make known what a wealth of glory is offered to the Gentiles in this secret purpose, Christ in you, the hope of glory. It is Christ whom we proclaim. We teach everyone and instruct everyone in all the ways of wisdom, so as to present each one of you as a mature member of Christ's body. To this end, I am toiling strenuously with all the energy and power of Christ at work in me. I want you to know how strenuous are my exertions for you and the Laodiceans and for all who have never set eyes on me. My aim is to keep them in good heart and united in love, so that they may come to the full wealth of conviction which understanding brings, 
and grasp God's secret, which is Christ himself, in whom lie hidden all the treasures of wisdom and knowledge. I tell you this to make sure no one talks you into error by spacious arguments. I may be absent in body, but in spirit I am with you, and rejoice to see your unbroken ranks and the solid front which your faith in Christ presents. Therefore, since you have accepted Christ Jesus as Lord, live in union with him. Be rooted in him, be built in him, grow strong in the faith as you were taught, and let your hearts overflow with thankfulness. the word of God in scripture, for the word of God among us, for the word of God within us. Thanks, Thanks be, be to, to God. God. Creator God, from quark to planet, your universe is awesome. Give us eyes to gape at the wonders daily about us and the will to live in the harmony of your creating. Help us to own the connection of all things, even at cost to our own wants and comforts, so we may live gently on earth and all creation praise you. Amen. On the 18th day of the month, we pray for the United Nations, the implementation of the Sustainable Development Goals, the United Nations Peacekeeping Forces, peace movements and organizations everywhere. 
and for the following countries East Timor, Indonesia, Brunei, Malaysia, Singapore, and Philippines. And we pray for the members belonging to the family group of D. Margaret Hart and Mike, Christine Jones and Trevor Jones, Jenny Lismore, Ben McGreevy Kearney, Colin McKenzie and Marion McNaughton, Ron Reed, John Smith and Margaret Smith. And on the 18th day of this month, we pray for associate members in Scotland East and South East, Edinburgh and the Lothians. Walk with them today, O God, and keep us on your way. God, in whose heart is love and justice, show us this day whom we must love and what we should challenge or change in order that your will for the earth might be done. Increase our hope, dispel our apathy, inspire our imagination and deepen our commitment until we become the signs of your kingdom for which we and others pray. Amen. This is the day that God has made. We, we will, will rejoice and be glad in it. We will not offer to God offerings, offerings that cost us nothing. Go in peace to love and to serve. We will seek peace and pursue it. In the name of the Trinity of love, God in community, holy and one.